Hello, Matthew Williams here with a quick video to talk to you about the DJI Mavic. Now, I haven't owned one, I haven't held one, I haven't operated one, but I am noticing the same old, same old that you get with DJI equipment. And it's present in this copter like it is with everything else. And unfortunately, DJI being a little bit fucking knobbish about their um, deleting people's comments off their page or rather hiding them so that the person themselves can see them so they think their comment is actually there for the world to see but they've hidden it so you can't have your comment on their page why do you have a comments section if you don't want people to comment honestly DJI this is part of the problem with DJI. DJI like to hide their faults. They like to hide their flaws. They don't like to talk about them. They don't like to admit they exist. And they don't like to service your equipment when it breaks because of one of their faults. Now this is the problem with DJI. They've got shitty service. Really shitty service. So much so that a lot of people don't even want to deal with them in the UK. But, that aside, what is it about the DJI Mavic that pisses me off? Well, it's quite simple. One simple thing, yeah, which is there in all the DJI fucking equipment until you start paying three or four thousand pounds. It's called yawing. Your movements, i.e. moving from left to right. Right, because this is not classed as a true professional, it's called a Mavic Pro, but it's not really pro, yeah, because it's that's just a fucking name to make everyone feel good, like they're you know they're getting pro gear. So if we use the name pro, then everyone will think we're getting pro. No, you ain't getting pro. The problem is their controller, right? Their shitty little controller. Basically, if you touch it will make the fucking copter go uh, and if you touch it uh, yeah that's the problem is that the fucking left to right movements are fucking severe yeah and there is no way to smooth that out okay and also the gimbal yeah it's got left to right smoothing in it, but that doesn't matter because once you touch the fucking left to right control, it'll be like that and it's too much for the fucking, for the gimbal to deal with. So, there's only so much you can do. You can fly forwards and you can fly sideways, but don't fucking turn left and right and definitely don't pan up and down because if you pan up and down, it's like a fucking robot. It's like, ah, uh, ah. Uh, yeah, and you see people having trouble with it. In all the footage I've seen so far, it's like if you leave it in one place and fly around, it's perfect. You know, not a problem, not a problem. But of course, most people will want to actually point up at some point. Yeah, but because you didn't pay the fucking mega bucks, yeah, the moment you touch that control, that's what you get with DJI, and you still got it in the Mavic. So fuck you DJI, even though it's fairly reasonably priced and the 4K camera it looks great. It's a really nice looking camera. The image quality is fantastic. I've seen the footage, I've seen the pixel peeping on it. It looks fantastic, but you just won't fucking leave people have those smooth controls, will you? You fucking won't. So there's my review of the Mavic. Would I buy it? No, because does it meet my needs? Absolutely not. Because I like smooth, smooth movement, you know, smooth panning, smooth tilting. Yeah, I don't want to just fly in and out of scenes like this and then fly sideways across scenes and fly in and out of scenes again. I want to fly in and turn, in and turn. Yeah, and I want the fucking panning up and down on the fucking, on the, on the good old gimbal to be smooth so not yet DJI I would like to spend the money on one if I had it but not yet that's the big problem so if you were expecting that to be any better in the Mavic 
No. They might bring it out in a firmware release, but I don't think so. Because they just want this. They do not want to give you this. Yeah? There's. It's always been the little sly fucking secret of DJI, and it's still there. So thanks for watching.